Hey, what's going on YouTube? Just another quick video. Today I'm going to show you how to fix the NVIDIA GeForce Experience error code 0x0003. There are many different methods out there to fix this error code, but the method I'm going to show you today is the method that worked for me. All right, so let's get started. The first thing we need to do is open up a web browser. Once we are there, we are going to type in nvidia.com slash drivers. Once on this page, you should see NVIDIA driver downloads. Here you will put your exact graphics card information. Now, if you don't know what graphics card you are running or you're just unsure, all we have to do is type in down on the bottom left corner. You'll see type here to search. All we have to do is type in DX Diag. That is DX DIAG and hit enter. This will bring up some computer information. You'll see system. And then next to that, you'll see display one and you'll see display two here in these tabs, you will get your exact graphics card information. This computer is currently running NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1060. Once you have input your graphics card information into the screen, you will click search. Then you will see GeForce game ready driver. We want to click download. Then you will see this screen. It says this download includes the NVIDIA graphics driver and an option to additionally install the GeForce Experience application. We are going to click download. Next, it's going to ask you if you would like to save this file and we are going to click save file. All right, so here in this screen, we are going to click NVIDIA graphic driver and GeForce Experience and we are going to click agree and continue. Then we are going to click on custom, custom advanced, and we are going to click next. All right, so in this next step, we are going to click perform a clean installation. And we are going to click next. Here in the screen, you will see NVIDIA installer has finished. And all you have to do is click restart now. But for this example, I'm just going to click restart later. Once you have restarted your computer, we are going to open up GeForce Experience. All right, so now as you can see, GeForce Experience has came up and it is working. All you have to do is sign in and you should be all good to go. If this video has helped you out, all I ask is to give this video a like and consider supporting the channel by subscribing. That is all I have for today. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.